Grr, gang, where you at, man? It's the boy, Goo Out, man, aka the big homie. Back at it again with another video, man. And I hope y'all boys is ready, because this is going to be a treat for y'all today, man. Now, I'm just going to ask y'all boys, if you haven't already, hit that like button. Please hit that like button already, man. And if you are new and have not hit that subscription button, make sure you hit that sub box, man, because we on the grind. Now. Y'all boys have been asking me, begging me for my bill. Y'all know every year I make the most dominant center bill all the time. I always make a good center bill, a great build actually. And I'm finna share with y'all today, man. This is honestly in my opinion. I'm not sure about any of the other center builds, you know what I'm saying? But I know as far as how I play, this is, if not the, one of the best center builds in this game. I kid you not, no regrets with this build. My player is a scoring machine, bro. So like, listen. I know I had to bring y'all this heat So I, without further ado, man, I'm gonna get right into it I'm gonna try to make this short and not drag it along So let's get right into this Now, as y'all know, as far as 2K18 goes It's a little bit different as far as making a player You have your primary and secondary skills So you have to be very cautious of what you make your primary and secondary You gotta make sure they match your play style But for this player, man, your primary, you're gonna wanna do driving and finishing Remember, this is a center right here just take a look at the stats and you're going to want to take a minute and change your secondary skill to shot creating. Now, I want y'all to just ignore the badges real quick. Ignore the Hall of Fame and gold badges and just look at the caps. Look at the attributes and the caps you get for the center right here. Look at your layups, dunks, ball handling. Look at the ball handling and the vertical stamina, speed, and acceleration on this player right here. This player is a beast, bro. You know what I'm saying? And you still get a lot of good badges which i'm gonna show you guys later in the video i'm gonna show you all the badges you get for this player right here but yeah man this i feel like is the best if not the best one of the best all-around centers in this game now as far as the height goes i'm not really a fan of uh you know what i'm saying seven three is good if you want to just you know what i'm saying be regular but I'm not really a fan. I like to be different. You know what I'm saying? Last year, 2K17, I had the seven foot center, seven foot stretch big. But this year, it's a little bit different. I didn't feel like seven foot would be the wave this year. You know what I'm saying? I didn't I didn't feel like I could really get away with it how I did last year. So if you're going for the height, I say either 7-3, if not 7-3, or maybe, maybe 7-1. You know what I'm saying? But you gotta make sure you know how to get rebounds and you max out your arm length and everything. Now, I know what a lot of y'all are thinking, oh, 7-1, seven, 7-0, one, seven, oh, but you're going to get outboard and you're going to get this and that. Rebounding is all about positioning, knowing how to crash, knowing how to box your man out and grab the rebound. So for this play, you're going to want to make your arm length maxed out. If not maxed out, you're going to want to go a maybe a couple inches shorter than that, just by a little bit. If you do not want to max it out, because you know what I'm saying, once you max it out, you, you lose a little bit of your three. You know what I'm saying? So if you want to, just just a little bit, I say 89.6. 89.6 is perfect right there. You know what I'm saying? That's what I would say. If you want to max it out, be fine and go ahead and max it out. I promise you. If you like to be an all-around player and you, you have like the play style, you like to do a little bit of everything, then this is the player for you. Now, as far as the weight goes, weight is very important in this game. Weight is very important in 2K18. So I'm not really a fan of heavy center, so I wouldn't max it out 340. That's the highest you can go for a center. So I would probably be on the safe side and say either 290 or 300 pounds. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a fan of heavy centers, you know what I'm saying? Even though this center is kind of fast, I wouldn't make them max weight because, you know what I'm saying? You want to be as fast as you can, know what I mean? So I feel like 300 is good. Or about 290. Now, as far as your shoulder width, you can go ahead and just max that out. You know what I'm saying? I just max out my shoulder width just to, you know what I'm saying? You could be dunking on people, you know what I'm saying, with no real problem, not me. I'm a fan of left-handed shooters. I feel like left-handed shooters shoot better than righties. That's just my opinion, man. So as far as the number goes, you can just put whatever number you want. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, this, if not the best, one of the best center builds in this game. You will not have no problems with this build right here if you upgrade them right and just play your role man i mean so hopefully this guy works out for you guys and once you do all them steps you put you should have a shot creating athletic finisher primary skill driving and finishing secondary skill shot creating 
Now remember, this is a center. Now if y'all boys just direct your attention here, I'm gonna be showing y'all the key badges, you know what I'm saying? I know this a lot, but I hope y'all still with me, you know what I'm saying? I hope y'all still with me, but this is the key badges you get for this my player. These are all your secondary badges, hustle rebounder, tireless scorer, defensive stopper, difficult shots, mid-range dead eye, chase down artist, drop step a charge card, up and under specialist, post spin technician, free throw ace, acrobat, rim protector, it's brick wall, it's just so many badges you get with this player. It's the like mix of shooting badges, big man badges, you know what I'm saying? That's why I love this archetype, because he can do it all. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to show y'all the caps one more time, the attribute caps one more time. Like I said, this is a dominant center. Hopefully it works out for you guys. Comment if you guys think this is a dope build, WRL. Like, make sure you like. Subscribe if you new, man. Much more on the way. It's been real. And I'm out of here, baby. Grrr.